Emerging markets um, had a tough 2012 compared to developed markets because uh, US housing came back very strongly and that drove a significant outperformance of developed markets over emerging markets. At the same time, China was seeing a slowdown, India was in a political paralysis, Brazil, Russia did not see that much growth. The markets that did continue to do well and are continuing to do well in 2013 also, the markets like Indonesia, Thailand, Malaysia, Philippines, markets which we don't talk enough about. We asked um, all our global analysts to come up with you know, some of the winning themes for the next 10, 15 years. And the one theme that they were most convinced about, which they had real conviction on, was consumption. Consumption because you know, there's a huge growth in the middle class population that you're seeing in emerging markets like India, Indonesia, Thailand, China. Uh, and that's really a theme that you can play in multiple ways. You can play that through developed market companies like Nestle, Unilever, Volkswagen, which make these products which the emerging consumer aspires to. And then you can play this theme also through companies listed in these emerging markets, uh, the likes of China Pacific Insurance, United Spirits, uh, East African Breweries, which provide these products to the consumers listed in those markets.